Hello everybody and welcome to a Pokemon Fire Red walkthrough or let's play or whatever you want to call it but today we are going to be starting our adventure in the Kanto region because my Pokemon Crystal let's play pretty much fell apart very quickly so we're going to be attempting a new one in this game so yeah nicknames are off limit nicknames are not going to be given to the Pokemon yet well, definitely not yet. I'm going to um, just go into my options and I'm going to put the text speed up to first. Okay, there we go. That should be better. Withdraw item and we're going to withdraw the potion that you get at the start of the game. So, basically we are going to go and talk to our mum downstairs. I think she's downstairs. Oh no, she doesn't want to talk to us. So, well, we'll just get on with the thing. So... Here we are in Pallet Town, the original town of the Pokemon. Hmm, that is right. Oh, look. I won't look. Mm, thank you. Okay, this guy. Technology is incredible. You can store and recall items and, and Pokemon as da data via PC. Okay, fair enough. Um, What's over here? This is someone else's house. My brother... Okay. My brother Butt is out at the lab. Okay, uh, that's Daisy. Seems to be our rival. Our rival's name is Butt. Yeah, a bit immature. Uh, so, okay, here we are. We've got something happening. Um, so this is Professor Oak. It's unsafe. Wild Pokemon live in tall grass. You need your Pokemon for your protection. I know, here, come with me. Okay, we're following him into the laboratory. Okay. Fair enough. Gramps, I'm fed up with waiting. Oh, but, let me think. Oh, that's right, I just told you, just wait. Here, come. There are three Pokemon here, haha. -ha. These Pokemon are held inside these Pokeballs. When I was young, I was a serious Pokemon trainer. But now in my old age, I only have these three left. You can choose one. Go on. Hey, Gramps, no fair! What about me? Be patient, but <laughs> You have... You can have one, too. I'm seriously going to change the name of that thing, I think. Um, let's see. Uh, so this one is Bulbasaur. But I'm not going to choose him. This one is Squirtle. I might choose him, but I'm just going to show off the last one. So, we are going to go onto a random name picker, which I'll just type up here, and we are going to choose one of them. Random name. Random name picker. Okay, so it's going to be C for Charmander. C for Charmander. B for Bulbasaur and S for Squirtle, so we're going to pick random, and just a sec, we are going to get Bulbasaur, so Bulbasaur is our choice for Pokemon, we hope that he'll be a good one. Duncan received, Duncan received, the, would you like to give a nickname to this Bulbasaur, um, I'll give him a nickname. Okay, uh, Roots, uh, Root, we'll call them Roots, because uh, when I was creating this file, I really just, yeah, my rival's nickname is a bit dodgy, just try to ignore that, um, so anyway, I'm gonna, uh, go do something now, uh, are we supposed to come down here? Wait, Duncan, let's check out our Pokemon. Come on, I'll take you on. And so we come into our first battle with Rival Butt. Rival Butt sent out Charmander. Okay, this should be easy enough. Oh, for Pete's sake, so pushy as always. Duncan, you've never had a Pokemon battle before, have you? A Pokemon is a battle when trainers win a tutorial. Oh, this is just a load of... This is just a load of rubbish. Um, 
I'm just gonna use Taco to take him the uh, inflicting damage on the inflicting damage on the foe. It's the key to any battle. Tarmander used Scratch. Tarmander used Scratch. Roots look used Taco. Uh, growl. There we go. Okay, it's attack fell. It's lowering the foe's stats will put you at an advantage. Oh, yes. I'll use that again. <laughs> Gonna be mean to our rival called Butt. <coughs> but <laughs> very funny. Very immature. Oh no, I think I'm actually going to lose the first rival battle. Oh no. Do I have to use it? Yes, I'm afraid I will have to use it. It's important to, to get to know your Pokemon thoroughly. This is a list of your Pokemon, Duncan. Open is to check the skills and moves of your Pokemon. You can also use Pokemon here if you want to use an item once. Keep your eyes on the Pokemon's HP. It will faint if the HP drops to zero. Charmander used Scratch, and we are going to use Tackle. And it missed! Thanks a lot! And it used Scratch again. So we go. My god, Roots! Your, your accu accuracy is terrible! Okay. We're going to just take him out. It was maybe a mistake to choose Roots as our. to choose Bulbasaur as our starter, but. I figure we'll get by if we can get a hound or something or, or a or a camera up or something like that. Okay, our Pokemon leveled up. Defeated rival. Okay, unbelievable. I picked the wrong Pokemon. I got eighty pounds for winning. Hmm, excellent. If you win, you earn prize money, and your Pokemon will grow. Battle the other trainers and make your Pokemon strong. Okay, that's good. Okay, I'll make my Pokemon battle to toughen it up. Duncan, Gramps, smell you later. Ah, oh, classic. Okay, where do I go now? Uh, I'm gonna go to Daisy's house. To see if she has that thing that she has just there ready. I heard you had, you had a battle against... I wish I had seen that. Oh. Fair enough, you're not going to give us a town map. Okay, I'm going to go up to this area. Okay, Route 1. This looks easy enough. Okay. Oh no, into a Pokemon battle straight away. First patch of grass, it's a Pidgey. I really shouldn't play this game. This will just poison the mind of all of those Pokemon Go players even more. When I want them to learn about the real Pokemon like Lula Lunala and Solgaleo and all that, I I'd probably just put images on them of them up on the screen. But anyway, I know what I'm gonna do before each gym. I'm going to overtrain. I'm gonna be like a Dallas Smash and just go full ultimate attack throttle on before I go and battle a gym leader or something like that. So oh, whoops, oh. oh. Whoopsie daisy, um, up we go, across here, across up, to speak to this guy. Okay, we can get back to, what, I didn't even move patch of grass, that's, that's just big poo. Go roots! Uh, use tackle. Yes, good, critical hit. Use tackle, oh no, use tackle. Good, killed it. And we leveled up to level 7. Okay, level 7. Roots grew to level 7. We learnt Leech Seed. Okay, we're gonna go up here. Gee, this the, the start of the game is pretty slow. Especially with your character moving at like what, one foot per second or something like that. Um, I'm gonna go to the Pokemon Center. Uh, save the game. Just a sec. I'm gonna heal my Pokemon back to perfect health. Yep. I'm just going to save the game as well. And I'll show you a little trick for doing that. 
when you're playing on emulators, it's easy to just click the fast forward button. So we're gonna come up here and we're gonna go over to the to the Pokemart and see what's in store over there. So up in there. Ah, hey, you came from Pallet Town. You know Professor Oak, right? His order came in. Can can you take it to him? Oak's parcel from. Duncan put Oak's parcel in the key items pocket. Okay, fair enough. Okay, we're gonna go deliver that parcel to Oak really quickly. Because we have speed up. Yes, the wonders of the world bring us to the speed up. Okay, we're gonna come down here, jump off those ledges. Ha ha! Stupid things. Now you don't. Now you don't win. Oh, I got a potion, thank you. Um, And we're going to go deliver that all to what's-his-name. Uh, so in we come. How is my old Pokemon? Well, it seems to be growing more attached to you. You must have been talented as a Pokemon trainer. What's that? You have something for me? I delivered Oak's Parcel. Ah, the custom Pokeball. I had it on all order, but Gramps! I really should stop saying that. I almost forgot, what did you call me for? Oh right, I have a request for you two. On my decks is my invention, the Pokédex. It automatically records data on Pokémon that you have seen of court. It's a high-tech high encyclopedia. Duncan and Butt, I would like these t you to take these with you. Duncan received the Pokédex from Professor Oak. You, ca you can't get a get detailed data on Pokemon just by seeing them. You must catch them to obtain complete data. So here are some tools for catching wild Pokemon. Duncan received five Pokeballs. Duncan put the Pokeballs in the Pokeball pocket. When a wild Pokemon appears, it's a fair game. Just throw the Pokeball at it and try to catch it. It won't always work, however. A healthy Pokemon can ex escape. You have to be lucky. To make a complete guide on all the Pokemon in the world. That was my dream. But I'm too old. I can't get the job done. So I want you to, to fulfill, my, fulfill my dream for me. Get moving, you two. This is a great undertaking in Pokemon history. Alright, Gramps, leave it to me. Duncan, I hate to say it, but you won't be necessary for this. I know. I'll borrow a town map from my sis. I can tell her not to lend you one, Duncan. Ha ha ha! You sound like water meets lava for goodness sake. That's funny. Don't bother coming around to my place after this. Yep, that definitely has the resemblance of water meets lava in him. Um. Yeah. So anyway, I'd like to thank you all for watching. That was stupid me. <laughs> uh, I'd like to thank you all for watching this video. If you enjoyed it. Well, good for you. But anyway, thanks for watching the first episode of Pokemon Fire Red and Leaf Green, and I will see you all in the next one.